Hello everyone, this is your boy, AnzGM here, and welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem Three Houses. That is correct, and then we are going to continue on with the with the next mission. I did some side stuff, and my units are like level 9 to level 10. They're ready to be certified as to another class, but not yet, because I need to get their skills first. So the pro that probably won't happen until they're like level 12, level 13, possibly level 14. Which is all good, I can still save up and such like that, but you know, I want to be sure about it. And yeah, so here we go, let's just get started and out my, my knee. Alright, so, mission. Let's see, so, the assault at the right of the rebirth, okay. While the plot is to assassinate the, uh, the Archbishop, shakes the monastery into his core. You suspect the enemy may have a different motivation. Uh, anxiety abounds out of the goddess right of birth commence. So here we go. Let's find out what is this all about. There we go. Assault at the right of the rebirth. White clouds trapped the port of God's rights rebirth. Okay. The right of rebirth is finally underway. Time to see if our hunch was right. Yeah. <sighs> I hope it's not. Then we wouldn't have to fight anyone. It's only the goddess knew us. Dear goddess, please protect us. Right or wrong, the clock is ticking. All we can do for now is stick to the plan. You seem a mite too relaxed for my liking. The Goddess's right of rebirth is about to begin. While we are in the Goddess Tower, we are relying on you to secure the locations that are lacking in defense. Okay. Can I let you in on something, Professor? My brother can be a bit... callous. He told me that he was concerned about you, and hinted that perhaps you would be better off patrolling a coffin. <laughs> That was said in jest, Flame, and in <laughs> Please just remain by my side and do not cause any more trouble. As a professor, you would do well to remember that it is your duty to guide your students down the path of righteousness. Please excuse us, everyone. We shall see you again after the ceremony has concluded. Sedith is way too overprotective. He reminds me of my brother. And my mother. Come on, Teach. I know a hidden spot where we can monitor the stairs that lead to the Holy Mausoleum. If there's anyone down there, they'll be trapped like the rats they are. We'll just have to take them down without getting bitten. Mm -hmm. Back to the subject at hand. What I found last night was a sealed coffin in the underground Holy Mausoleum. I did some research, and the only time you can easily get in and out of that place is during the Rite of Rebirth. And because of that alleged assassination plot, it has even thinner defenses than usual. It's all too clear. All right. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thank you. I am grateful. Alright, Eunice, let's see. Uh, get out of here. Alright, let's see. Um, let's see. Let's look up. Let's... Okay, so here we go. What is this? Holy shit, he's wearing a scythe! What is that? Craft using... Ancient methods, this imitates things, this that's... It is choice. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Am I supposed to fight this dude? Why is all of his stuff, like, upgraded except for face? Allows you to take certified exam that... that uses dark magic. Oh, shit! Am I really supposed to fight him? Monastery intent. If the units, if you didn't initiate combat, grants a what? Allow. What the? What is this? Allow the unit. What? This encounter. You're lying. Oh my god, is this Death himself? 
Command it notifies instant de uh, death effects, status effects, and movement. And greatly reduces damage from enemies. Yeah. What the fuck is this? Poison strike. Are we supposed to fight him? No, 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 that isn't right. That isn't right. This, this is the real boss right here. I see some, that some people are actually trying to fight this damn thing. Alright, you guys, let's do this. Our guess was spot on. Looks like we have company. One of those Central Church dasters have spotted us. Buy me some time while I open the seal on the casket. I'm on it. Looks like the enemy is going after the casket in the back. Maybe they're going after the saint's bones? Weird. I'd like to defeat them before they can finish the job. Defeat the enemy general within 25 turns and protect the casket. But did you notice? Look closely at the ground. There's some kind of contraption on certain parts of the floor. The smart move is to advance while finding the best fighting positions we can, based on the enemy's weaponry. Oh, it's gonna... Commander, all right. But he has DC. That's su that's such BS, though. Oh, all right. Ready and willing. So, Death Knight, prove your strength and scatter these fools. I don't take commands or waste my time on weaklings. I'm getting a really disturbing vibe from that guy. No one go near the evil looking knight, okay? Yes. I mean, I think. No, wait, I got rid of the combat arm from the. Okay, yeah. Um. And there's no point in fighting that. Base stats total. My highest is like. Yeah, there's no way I'll be able to win. Yeah, there's no way. I'm not. I'm not gonna even go uh, attempt at doing that. Even if those things are like kind of like, like. But I don't understand why people try to do that. You're not gonna win. I mean, unless you're playing in casual mode, then that's different. But that's. There's no way for me. I'm gonna be able to do that. Nope. Uh, uh, I'm not taking my chances. Yeah. 
Let's go! You're making me work. Hey! You lost to me? Too easy. Let's see how the moves back one space. Whoa! Won that. Level ten, boys. I think I've gotten stronger. Bring it on. Just give up. Sorry, the victory is mine. You got that right. Fabregasta that he has distant counter! Distant counter! Do you have to learn I think I think you have to be an A, like an A Lance and to, to learn that. Because in bow, like because bows you learn that at C for for a close counter, but damn! That's super crazy and super good! Go for it! Alright, let's see. We're doing good so far. Uh, let me see. Uh, turn raises that raises resistance. Okay. That's so. <laughs> Yo, that's that that that's just a bit too much.
Okay. There we go, come on. There we go, come on, let's go. Give me your health! I guess it worked out. A level 11. I guess I feel a little stronger. Oh, there's a chest there. I didn't even notice that. Bring it on! Bring it on! haven't arrived hmm. if they approach from behind we can attack them from both sides Careful. Yo, overkill. I didn't even mean to do oh wow I meant to do combat art okay uh, let's see about to be level 11. Alright, let me look at it. Alright, my this one. She's really close, so I could so I could upgrade her later. Hang on a second. Class experience. Mastery unlock uh, you name it. Alright, let's see. Get rough. You can say that again. There we go, let's go. <laughs> suits me well. Are you kidding me? Come on. Get that critical head. Come on. Crit.
Nah. Nah, nah, I feel like that's a trap. I'm not doing it. Okay, all right, good. So, so far we're doing good. We just have to like get these units down here. Sword and then sword. Okay, okay, that's good, that's good. All right, uh, I'm gonna leave. Uh... I forgot which one had the key. Was it her? Oh, she has the key. Let's see, um, you need to level up, so let's just, what's your weapon ability like? Wow, you're, okay, alright, might as well get, might as well get you to, to Lance, let's go. What's next? Oh, so close! Me. Like you didn't do nothing. Let's go. You gotta be kidding me. A twenty fucking five percent hit rate. My boy, that's like a graduation pose. I'm not even lying. I mean, honestly, I don't want to reinforce this because then I can level up more. I'll kill you right now. Oh, you live. so far I think everything is going well here, so let's go. Much needed. Oh my god, they're coming! Let's think carefully. What was that? This is our chance. What was that? Don't waste it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me!
Yeah, you're dead. You're dead. You deserve to die. Sorry, did I hurt you? I'm still a delicate flower, you know. Nah, girl, you know how to hold a you know you know how to hold hold on your own. No hesitation. Yes! Sir! Each battle a chance to grow. That was amazing. what I need. There we go. You're out of luck. Guess I've gotten better. This might be my limit. No, it's not. You're gonna live, understand me? Level 11, let's go, let's keep it going. Another step forward. And you know what the thing is that I'm doing this with eight units. I'm supposed to use ten. Oh, no! 
There we go. You underestimated me. He's so close. Wait. Okay. then Heal him up. Thanks for that. Bring it. Jesus. Oh, these magic fuckers. You're dead. There we go, yeah. You're not gonna be able to take care of that. Just turn twelve, okay. Pretty sure in casual mode you could beat this man. 
Like, I'm pretty damn sure. But, like, it's gonna be impossible to do it. Like, unless, unless you have, like, that effective thing. I don't even think that effective thing will be enough to take this man down. Cause, cause usually when you, when there's like a boss like that, you're not supposed to fight. Like, at all. This man is a, like, he's a tier... Yeah, is I think he's a tier, tier three. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Hang on. Uh. uh Death Knight. Death Knight, a classified to in darkness shadow by shadows uses a match you can move again after certain actions. I think I I I think I think it's just an exclusive because I don't see it anything in here. Wow. It's probably it's probably it's probably Dark Knight. Yeah, I, I, like yeah yeah it's Dark Knight. Yeah, it has to be Dark Knight. Yeah, at most Dark Knight. That's a tier three, and we're like tier one, so there's no way in hell we're gonna win. I'll just take the head. So be it. There we go. Got it. Good to go. Uh, let's see. Our sword needs more, so. There we go. Never underestimate an outsider. You're so dead. You sure do. Uh, I'll manage. Allow me to demonstrate. Come on, that wasn't meant for you. That wasn't meant for you. That wasn't even meant for you. Might as well. You're too late. The seal will be broken any minute now. It is decided. Whoa! Ooh. Miss! <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. So nice of you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, get rid of this. Alright. Yeah, 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 trade it, trade it, trade it, trade it. I don't know if he's gonna do that again, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna wait it out. Wait, he can just encounter four-way like 
in two spaces? That's nuts! What if that is... What? That is so dumb! Unless that's doing his weapon. What the fuck? And I'm surprised Claude can even take a hit if I use the mini bow. Get rough. There we go. Yeah, you're going down now. He's about to level again. Yeah, my boy deserves it. My boy deserves it. Oh, yeah. It's no use. The seal is broken. You can't... Uh, a sword. A sword? Ooh, what is this? Yo! It's the creative sword! What? Ooh! What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> that ain't gonna do much to you, boy! Ooh. Yo, you just- Yo, he just ended that man's life! I know he was a threat, but holy shit! Yo, that was crazy. My sword is... I see. What a pleasant surprise. The jerk got away. Was that magic? We can't even chase after him. Hey, Professor, the way that sword is shining, do you think it could be... Is the intruder here? Oh, looks like you have this under control. Oh, you. yeah. Round up any stragglers. Yep. Yo, that was crazy. Oh! MVP Hilda, yo. I really like Hilda. Not gonna lie. At, at, if, at one of these runs, if she dies, like, I am gonna be so... I mean, th but then again, I got, like, three tries of, like, resetting the character, so... Oh lord, that day will be shocking, and like I'll, I'll I'll be like, no, I just I lost her. Sword of the Creator. This mysterious blade unleashes its true power and blinks hand, extended to reach distant enemies. The weapons their abilities restored by five each time. Let the chooses to rest on her day off. Okay. Oh. Okay. Ooh, that was crazy. As all of you have committed a breach of faith, the Archbishop will now pass judgment. Inciting a kingdom noble to rebel. Unlawful entry. The attempted assassination of the Archbishop. An attack on the Holy Mausoleum. It is unnecessary to go on, followers of the Western Church. What? We have nothing to do with the Western Church. You have already been identified. Please spare us your second-rate theater. Dishonoring a holy ceremony is worthy of death for a member of the church. You are well past the hope of redemption. 
If you have any grace remaining, you will willingly offer your life as atonement for this crime. No. This isn't what we were told would happen. We've been deceived! It's no use arguing. Whatever your excuse, the punishment stands. May your souls find peace as they return to the Goddess. Wait! Please! The Goddess would never forgive you for our execution! Monster! We know you've already slaughtered many of our fellow brethren like this. This concludes the investigation. Please remove these poor lost souls from my sight. I suppose that's that. The assassination attempt, the attack on the Holy Mausoleum... Looks like it was all a plot by the Western Church. It's just too bad that that masked knight who was leading the attack got away. Vanished without a trace. But why would the Western Church want to attack Lady Rhea? Why? Take your pick of reasons. Relations with the Western Church aren't exactly friendly. You know, the thing is that, looking at the entire thing, like, um... I think Claude doesn't agree with uh, Lady Rhea's, like... Like, like, yes, I know what they did. Oh, well, the thing is that we don't even know that that the Western Church was actually involved. But if the people said that they would deceive, you know, that could be another thing, you know, and such like that. But, like, she don't want to hear anything. Like, they are dead. Like, dead straight away. But execution wise uh that's uh that's a hard one right there like like there's always two sides for this one yes i know the assassination on lady Rhea was was a big no-no okay like that cannot happen but at the same time we don't know the other side of the story what what reasons oh that's right Gerald mentioned that you grew up completely isolated from the church. The Church of Saros is split into a few different branches across Fodlan. Right. The Central Church is headquartered right here at Garrick Mach. Right. Then there's the Western Church. Far west from Castle Gaspar, where Lord Lanato had his little rebellion, is the fortress city of Aryan Road. Okay. It's the strongest fortress in the kingdom. On the other side of it is the headquarters of the Western Church. All right. Not too smart to bicker with people who worship the same goddess as you. The bishop of the Western Church must be pretty ambitious. Probably hopes to split off completely. In which case, he'd need to weaken the Central Church's influence. Killing Rhea is certainly one way to do that. To the shock of no one, I hear the knights have been sent to subdue the leaders of the Western Church. We'll probably get a chance to assist. You're an odd one, aren't you, Professor? How'd you make it this far in life without ever interacting with the church? Good question. I can't believe someone like you exists in Fodlin. It's too strange. If you think that's weird, consider the fact that Rhea hired Teach despite all that. So those guys they caught, they all got the axe, right? That's brutal. Yo, the axe! Oh my god, this taking way Yo, execution style these days! Holy shit! Lady Rhea can be rather intimidating at times. In fact, she can be downright terrifying. Yo, the axe! Yo, those are the old, old time wars. Professor, those who cannot be saved must be delivered to the goddess for judgment. Is that not so? There you are, Professor. It seems Lady Rhea would like a word with you. Come with me. Okay. It's about that sword. It's about the sword. The Archbishop lives. Mm -hmm. Not that I had ever placed much faith in those swine from the Western Church. Okay, so it was from the Western Church, okay. Maybe the Western Church didn't want... Maybe they were deceived, and they decided to, to do it. But the problem... But I believe they were controlled. That's it. I have news. Both good and bad. The remains of Saros were not in a tomb. However, something else was. The Sword of the Creator. Ah, the weapon wielded by that thief, the King of Liberation. Thief? Huh. At any rate, it is now in the hands of the Academy's new professor. I doubt you will be surprised to hear that the Crest Stone had already been removed from the sword when it was found. 
Okay. Hmm. As expected, it would be foolish to keep both in the same location. All right. There's more. The professor was able to awaken the sword's true power. Even without the crest stone, the sword glowed red. The professor's crest is compatible. There is no mistaking it. Hmm. Absurd. Using a relic without its crest stone should be impossible. The King of Liberation's bloodline should not even... Hmm. They must be allowed to keep it, for now. I do not have enough information about the Professor to act. As for your request, I assent. The Death Knight is at your command. Use him well. Oh, good. I believe I will enjoy this a great deal. That Death Knight was scary as hell. That thing was I cannot frightening. thank you enough for defeating those invaders in the Holy Mausoleum, and especially for protecting the Sword of the Creator. That sword is one of the hero's relics, and the most precious artifact in the Church's possession. It is also a weapon of terrifying power. I can see that, to consider the fact that it grew red. For now, I will entrust the sword to you. Please, use it wisely. Lady Rhea, wait. Do you truly mean to give the sword of the Creator to this stranger? Surely it is not the sort of thing one hands over so readily, even to someone who has the ability to wield it. If someone like Nemesis were to appear again, all of Vodlin would be consumed by war. Nemesis, the King of Liberation. He is an ancient king of mankind who was defeated by Seros over a thousand years ago. All right. When Fodlin was attacked by wicked gods, it is said that the goddess gifted Nemesis with the sword of the creator. Nemesis used that sword to defeat the wicked gods, saving all of Fodlin. Henceforth, he was dubbed the king of liberation. All right. However, his power began to corrupt him until he himself turned to the darkness. Saint Seros was forced to destroy him. Lady Rhea, I beg you to reconsider. Given a little more time, we could more accurately assess this stranger's abilities. No. I have faith, Sedeth. Faith that our friend here will not be corrupted by wickedness. Since the death of Nemesis, none have been able to wield the Sword of the Creator. Now, after all those long years of being sealed away, it has returned and found a new master. I understand. As you wish, Lady Rhea. There you have it, Professor. See that you do not betray the trust the Archbishop has seen fit to bestow upon you. I mean it. I mean, like, there's no... I mean, even if I did, she... My, my head is cut off, so either way, I'm screwed. The Sword of the Creator? The King of Liberation? Each tale is more confusing than the last. And I really can't read that Rhea at all. Yeah, she's so weird. Like, like she's putting... Like, I'm pretty sure in real life there's actual people that have, like, like, have faith towards others and such. So, like, I get that, but it's just, like, there's no signs of, like, what is she really doing? I'm pretty sure I'll find out later on in the in the end, but like, damn. That sword is clearly precious. So why is she so keen to gift the thing to you? Exactly, like, like first of all, I've been, I've been, I've been brought to the monastery. I have been given to teach the students. Um, lead them into battle where death, where where the students itself can, can die, especially they're literally teenagers. And I've been given to a sword that's been sitting away for how for maybe thousands of years. And you're telling me that for who knows how long I've been there, probably for two months, two months already in, in the game time period, you're giving me the sword. Instead of like, I don't know, like like have me in a monastery for a little longer, maybe like a year or two, and then wield the sword? Probably to know? No, you just want to give it to me straight away and such. Like, I really don't get it. Feel as though we have become entangled in a mystery. Yeah. And there is one more thing that has been plaguing me. The sword of the creator. It somehow feels distinct from other relics we have seen. 
Such as the one that... Oh, goodness, what was her name? Cat... Cat... Uh... Catherine. Yes, her. The sword of the creator is different from her thunderbrand in one key way. Yeah. It bears a hole where something should have been, but is no more. Yeah. I despise not knowing what is going on. It... it frightens me. And yet, I place my trust in you. I must. Well, that's your fault. You shouldn't have been at, you should have not got you should not have been in my conscience. Whatever comes to pass, please swear to cut a path that is your own. The sword of the creator, pulled right from the legends. I finally found it, and yet it ended up in Teach's hands. <laughs> you got a problem with that? Could I even use it anyway? Damn it. There's no telling what's to come. You wanted to use it yourself? Part 1. White Clouds. Verdant Rain Moon. Tower of Black Winds. The ceaseless rains that satiate the verdant landscape of Fodlin are accompanied by fierce winds and mighty roars of thunder. This abundance of rain, sparkling as it falls against beams of emerging sunlight, is a constant reminder to the people of Fodlin that nature is ever wild and unpredictable. For when the rain finally does take pause, the clouds part and give way to a glorious rainbow. I have a new mission for you, Professor. Ah, <sighs> another mission. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. I would like for you to take your students into Kingdom territory to eliminate some thieves. They stole a hero's relic from House Gautier of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. The Lance of Ruin. The Lance of Ruin? Your leader's name is Miklan. He is apparently a disowned son of House Gautier. I actually want to know why Church of the This skirmish involves a holy relic, and is therefore more than a single noble is capable of resolving. The hero's relics are immensely powerful weapons. We must meet this threat with adequate force. Unfortunately, most of the Knights of Seros are away from the monastery, purging the apostates of the Western Church. Okay. So we are entrusting you with this mission. After all, you wield the sword of the Creator which is more than capable of opposing any relic. The Sword okay. of the Creator is a powerful weapon well beyond the other relics. You have nothing to fear. However, to ensure that no harm comes to the students, we will also send the Monastery's most skilled individuals to aid you. I don't want them! I want to... I want to... You know, build my units up? I must remind you that you are expected to conduct yourself in a manner befitting the wielder of that holy sword. Also, you should know that Professor Hanneman has been looking for you. That is all. Oh, man. That man? Oh, hey, Teach. I gotta say, I never would have guessed you were a descendant of the King of Liberation. You're just making stuff up, but hey, it's hey. Right. You didn't forget, did you? That story I told you about a relic that could cut a mountain in half? That relic was the Sword of the Creator, the very same used by Nemesis, the King of Liberation. Oh. I'm not his descendant. <laughs> Don't be coy, Teach. The Sword of the Creator could only be wielded by Nemesis. If you can use it too, that can only mean you have that bloodline's crest. I don't understand. Fine. Keep your secrets, but just so you know, <laughs> I don't understand isn't going to cut it here at the monastery. Yo, my boy, if I really don't understand, how the hell am I supposed to explain myself? Yo, yo, don't push yourself. I could punch you. Speaking of, Professor Hanneman has been looking for you. He probably wants to examine your crest with those crazy instruments of his. Actually, sounds amusing. Maybe I'll tag along. If it isn't my little Claude, what has you so worked up? Is that your mom? Judith, what are you doing here? 
That's Lady Judith to you, boy. I told you, until you're in charge, I expect you to address me with all due respect. Anyway, I'm here to retrieve you. Duke Regan's condition has taken a turn for the worse. Oh. Are you saying the old man's on his deathbed? No, it's not that bad. But in the state he's in, he won't be able to participate in the next roundtable conference. He wants you to go in his stead. I volunteered to play the messenger. Well, thanks for that. Oh, and uh, Teach, this is Judith, also known as the hero of House Daphnel. So you're little Claude's teacher, are you? How much trouble has he been giving you? <laughs> I wanted to say her nickname didn't give it away. You should know that Judith, uh, Lady Judith, is the leader of the famous House Daphnel of the Leicester Alliance. She used to be a big deal at the roundtable conferences, but it seems of late she's been reduced to a mere... You had better shut that mouth before I put my boot in it, you tactless nuisance. Now come on, let's get going. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Professor, but I need to borrow the boy for a bit. I suppose we'll have to finish our chat later. Sorry, Teach, but don't you worry. I'll be back in time for our next mission. All right, Judith, let's get going. It's Lady... Uh, I suppose you are the active leader for the time being. Fair enough, boy. Fair enough. <laughs> Yo. Good of you to come, Professor. Oh, Pretty Lord. About you lately. More and more. I just want to save it. End this. <laughs> okay. Good of you to come, Professor. Okay. Specifically, that you are able to awaken the sword of the Creator's power. Thusly, it seems the true nature of your crest has been uncovered. I had, of course, seen your crest before. However, at first, I failed to recognize its true nature. Right. Eventually, it dawned on me that what is visible is perhaps merely a small part of a greater whole. In other words, your crest is too significant to be detected when using normal instruments. After this discovery, I began researching crests that might fit that description which allowed for a temporary hypothesis. However, I could not be certain. The crest my conclusions led me to was far too unusual. A crest thought to have disappeared from this world in the millennium since the fall of Nemesis, the King of Liberation. I'm recording. The crest of flames. That is what you possess. The Crest of Flames. Interesting. Your ability to wield the Sword of the Creator has unequivocally proven my hypothesis. Really? A legendary power, dormant since time immemorial and now resurrected. Hmm. There can be no doubt that this ancient power resides within you. Interesting. Okay, I okay, so I got like no wait, I gotta visit the monastery around town and then I got like a three times to grind. Alright, cool. I'm good, I'm good then. Do my thing. What? Wow. Oh. Okay, so then I guess I have to explore the place a bit and then do battle. Okay. Let's see how it is then. Uh let's look at let's look at the certifications, you know, for our units that we can do. Let's see, let's see. If I wanted to make him an armor knight, you know. Heavy armor. Okay, so I gotta I have to have at least this heavy armor to like D and such. I mean, I could make him to it now, but no 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 no. I can't. I have to I have to master the skill. That's what I really want to do though. Yo! His armor though black and I mean he's covering his mouth, but like damn, that's sick. Yo, I really like I really like his uh so uh, what you would call it, like, uh, like, uh, like the design of that? That's sick. It's an armor knight, and yeah, he shows a uh, wielding axes. Okay, that's. I see how it is. Yo, brigade. Yeah, but, yeah. Of course, we're gonna make a brigade. Of course. Yo, there's so many of these that I want that I want to do. Get these two out of here. I don't want to see them. 
Uh, Paladin, of course, you know, the other stuff. Like, like, th like these right here, um... Wow. He could be an armor knight if I, if I wanted to do it. Brigade! No, 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 I need to have his... Wait, his axe is C or higher. No, 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 brawler, brawler, there we go, brawler. Has to be... Oh my god! That's cool! Uh, guys, and, and just and just letting you know, he has not been a damn lord. As much as I really, really love the the outfits, archers will have his benefits. I know his outfit looks looks really, really bad. I know his outfits look really bad. Okay, but I'm just saying, I'm going to make him an archer, whether you guys like it or not. Like. And that's a guarantee straight fact. Ooh, there's so much stuff I gotta do here. I'm going house versus house, lands of the tournament. Okay, alright, I might as well just explore the monetary while I'm at it. But other than that, that's gonna be the end for it. End for it, you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed what you saw, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, follow me on my Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. All links will be in the link in the description down below. Share this with friends and family what they think. And as always, you guys. Stay tuned for the next video. This is your boy, Anzi GM here, and he is out of here. Later!